Hey guys, this is Matt, aka Download Some RAM. These are some Velkaz build paths in a flash, let's get to it. Starting with the core build for Velkaz mid, you have Morella Namakan into Ludens Echo, followed by Sorks, Rylai's Leandries, and a Void Staff. The early mana regen given by Morella Namakan is absolutely crucial on Velkaz, given that he will be spamming abilities right out of the gate. Now, if you are a weak, quivering mass of Void Goo, however, you can replace the Morella Namakan with an Athene's Unholy Grail to build up some magic resist without sacrificing the mana regen. Luden's Echo serves as your biggest boost in flat AP while also providing some much needed movement speed to Velkaz. Vel works very well with move speed, so don't hesitate to drop the extra coin on those new Steph Currys, cause this right here is the fastest squid known to mankind. Now Rylai's Crystal Scepter may tie with Luden's Echo in the flat AP department, but it does give much needed tankiness to Vel as well as providing my personal favorite item passive in the game. Plus, you know, your Q already slows, so why not make it slow even more? It's just a science, really. The Leandry's Torment that follows already has legendary synergy with Rylai's Crystal Scepter, and that, on top of the tankiness that you gain for Velkaz, is absolutely unbeatable. And the Void Staff at the end of the build serves to show any opponent that there is simply no amount of magic resist that can save you from the Learn Laser. And that just about wraps up Velkaz's build path, so thanks for watching, now get out there!